Oh, let me comment on this. Bobby Lee, who obviously named after General Robert E. Lee. And a lot of you guys know Bobby Lee is a beautiful um, Korean or semi-Korean comedian. And uh, he has a podcast called Tiger's Belly, which is also a rare food, I think. It's a rare food, and it's also a nickname for diarrhea, which is then a nickname for Nick Swartzen. But I'm going to tell you, Bobby Lee decided to uh, drop a little homage, which is French and also I think is a cheese, to your boy by getting the same haircut. So, Bobby, you want to step out here and do, to uh, my uh, territory, bro? That's what I'm seeing here. But let me tell you that it's not just a, this, what you wandered into, Robert, is not just a, a, a style, man. It's an embodiment of something bigger than yourself. Dude, this uh, it's that BYO Tarzan, bro. It's like having something just swinging off the back of you. You know what I'm saying, dude? Anybody could just have hair. Think Tons of things have hair, dude. Even some women have a little bit of hair on their chin, bro. You know, and they might work at the library or whatever. But what I'm telling you, Robert, or Bobby, as you go by, which is obviously a racist name, but I'm telling you this, Bobby, that you can't just just try to embody my fucking follicle karate, bro. You feel me? You can't just try and duplicate my gator cape, baby. Okay? Because you hear... Whoosh, whoosh. When I turn my head, you hear that... Fuck, whoosh, 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 whoosh. You hear that tail flip around, bro. That thing... Whoosh, that thing will bite a baby at Disney World, bro. I ain't playing. This haircut ain't playing, Robert. And I saw you the other day, Bobby. And you look like uh, Rosie O'Donnell. That's what you was looking like, man. With your long hair, I seen it. And now, you're trying to come at your boy. And the slept kingdom wants to challenge the rat kingdom. Well, let me just tell you, little daddy. That this is a working man's cut. This isn't one of these uh, sleeping cuts that you like. Your hair before would have tested positive for uh, temper pedicness. What I'm saying is you, you, you're going to have to wake up, Bobby. Because the haircut you have now that you've grown in, that you come into, this adult men's haircut, before you had a children's cut. You know, kind of a thick child maybe that it... Um, Never done well on standardized tests and then was put into a unique school for children that learn more by shapes and by, you know, um, soft items. But now you have a real senior's haircut, man, a man's cut. And this is a full-bodied style. You know, this thing has aroma coming off of it. You know, you got that haircut now, man. Uh, look. I'll tell you, sometimes I turn around and there'll be six raccoons behind me and two of them doing dice, bro. And one of them's cutting up a gram. So it's just, you're entering a realm that I don't know if you're prepared for. And I don't know if you're welcome. Well, thanks for watching that video right there. That was a beautiful little segment, I think. But of course, I'm partisan to myself. But you can move on to another video right now. You can check on this video or on this video. That's two different options. And you can also subscribe to the channel. Check on a new video. Subscribe to the channel. Check, subscribe, check, 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 subscribe, subscribe.